Well, as the world marks Entrepreneurship Week, South Africa's youth uh, are being urged to turn to entrepreneurship as high unemployment persists. Now, the education department, or system rather, has failed, has also been identified as the best platform to equip young people with entrepreneurial skills. For more on this, we are joined by teacher and entrepreneur himself, uh, Sean Fuchs. Thank you so much uh, for joining me this afternoon. Mr. Fuchs, how would you say can the education sector basically prepare students for entrepreneurship? I think at the outset that uh, education, uh, the world has changed completely. And unfortunately, education hasn't moved with that. And one of the things that should be happening is how we revise the curriculum. And for me, there are subjects that need to be removed because I don't think certain of the subjects are relevant. And we actually need to bring something like entrepreneurship in as, as a set subject for our students. And... Would you say this is a very crucial thing that needs to happen or be fast-paced to get those extra subjects in? And what are some of those subjects that you would say you would take out or replace them with? The, the first subject I would remove is probably life orientation. And probably thousands of parents and teachers and students might celebrate after making that comment. Um, we, uh, I'm the founder and CEO of Centennial Schools. And uh, we opened the school two years ago with the idea that we're going to completely reimagine today's schools. And that's exactly what we've done. We brought in uh, entrepreneurship as a subject, additional to the normal curriculum, so the normal CAPS curriculum. And uh, our students spend an entire year, we partner with a Canadian organization, and they r physically run businesses, even though they're digital, uh, sort of uh, by a game that they play but they're actually running businesses. So starting up small entrepreneurial businesses like from a lemonade